Hey y'all, um, I'm out in the uh, out in the mountains, out in the country. But a couple weeks ago, I was at a car show and I met uh, this husband and wife who had uh, matching Super Bs. One's a '69, one's a 2007. And uh, if y'all been watching my channel, you've seen Dwayne's '69. And now what I want to do is bring you uh, his wife Vicky's 2007. It's a very nice car too. So uh, let me get this camera reset and uh, we'll take a look at this car. Vicky, how are you? Fine. How are you? Not too bad. Tell me a little bit about your hot rod. Uh, it's a 2007 Dodge Charger SRT8 Super B. Um, it has a 6.1 liter Hemi. Uh, it's 425 horsepower from the factory. Everything's original about the car. I haven't changed anything. The color on it's detonator yellow. There was only 1,000 of these cars made in 2007 in detonator yellow. They were all detonator yellow. Yes, yeah. they were. And what, uh, I mean, your husband's got the 69. Is that what inspired you to go down and get a 2007? Or have you kind of been a hot rodder all your life, too? Well, my husband had a Super B when I originally wanted this one. But um, he actually fixed his car to match my car. I had my car first. Oh, before I see. He oh, wow. His. Okay. So I got the order out of, I got the order mixed up. Right. <laughs> so, Dwayne, you went and did your car because your wife got this car, right? I actually picked the color. Yeah, cool, cool. Do you like it? Yes, I love it. How many miles do you have on it? Uh, it's almost 41,000. Oh, so you drive it all the time. Yes, it's my family car. Wow. How do you keep it so nice? Uh, a lot of elbow grease. Yeah, that's how you do it, isn't that's it? Right. Washing and waxing and all that. Yeah. Do you do that yourself or do you get Dwayne to do it? I do it myself. Sometimes I can talk him into it, but most of the time I do it on my own. Get him to rinse it off once in a while, yeah. right? Yeah, I gotcha. <laughs> Well, cool. Do you, you really enjoy driving the car, I guess, then? I do. I've always had performance cars, and I love this one. Yeah. I wouldn't take anything for it. Yeah, no, I don't blame you. Yeah, it's a Actually, very cool car. Actually, I didn't buy the car. He went and bought the car for me. No kidding. I had talked about liking them, and he came in and said, I got you a car, so he brought it home to me. Well, he's a heck of a guy, isn't he? He's a pretty good feller. <laughs> you going to keep it for a while? Uh, I plan to, unless something happens that I have to get rid of it. Right, I, right. I would love to be able to just put it up and not drive it because I think in the future it will really be a collectible item. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of a thousand, surely. Yeah. yeah. And then the uh, Super B comes with uh, the bigger Hemi, the 6.1. Right. Comes with bigger brakes. Yes. Different wheels. Yellow stitching. And it's obviously a limited number. It comes plaqued. Yes. Yes. So, cool. And then the decals for the Super B. Yes. Yeah, cool. All right, well, let's stand back and take a look at this thing then. I have been looking for one of these folks, but um, actually my cousin's got one. He's got a blue one, but uh, this one is this one is just so nice. I can't believe. I would have never guessed it had 41,000 miles on it. 4,100 miles? Yes. 41,000 miles? No way. I mean, because look, I mean, she doesn't have a bug mark. She doesn't have a scratch, a, a rock chip, nothing. I don't know how she does that. You know how particular I am about my Mustang, and it's got about that on it, but it's got stone chips, everything else all over it. And then it's running 20s, it's got the special SRT wheels, it's got the big brake kit on it. Very cool, and then it's got the Super B emblems up here. I'm not sure why they went with a four door and not a two door, but that was Chrysler's deal there. They didn't offer them in a two door, so. You take what you can get. It's just a cool car. And it's got a Hemi, so you know, everybody likes that. Now those original tires, or have you replaced those? Uh, they came on the car, but I don't believe they are original. Did you not buy it new? I didn't buy it new. Okay. How many miles was on it when you got it? Uh, 32,000. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, whoever had it before you took good care of it, too. Uh, yeah, they seem to. What is uh, a good story is we had went a few years ago when these cars first came out, and my husband talked about us buying one. And I told him, I said, dream on, you yeah. know, because they were just too expensive. They're like 80 grand new, 75 grand new, right? Um, I think more like 50, something okay. around there. But anyway, I told him, I said, dream on. So anyway, in the winter last year, I ended up wrecking my truck that I had. 
and totaled it. And so that is how I ended up with this. Just so happened when he went shopping for a vehicle, he was going to buy a nice family economy car. Right. Because we had a truck that used a lot of gas. Right. And so when he went to buy a vehicle, his nice family economy car came back as this. Oh, jeez. So, well, who can complain? <laughs> Let's take 20 a look. miles a gallon, though, so I can't complain with 425 horsepower. No. Let's take a look at the inside, can we? You can see it's got the yellow stitching on it. And then these door sills came in it, too? Yes. Okay. Everything is original. And it's loaded out. It's got nav. It's got everything, right? Yes. 180 mile an hour speedometer. You know that begs to ask you how fast you've had it. I've had it about 110, and I don't want to go no faster. Right. I can kick it at 110 and it set me back in the seat, so. Wow. And I love the carbon fiber in it. Wow, very, very cool car. Can we hear it start? Sure. That's just new, new cars are so quiet. Dwayne, I gotta give it to you on sound. Well, okay. <laughs> she didn't like that. Mine still sounds better. I think so. Alright, that's cool. Pop that hood so we can look under there too. Saw your girlfriend's envious? Or they don't even know what you got, do they? They probably don't even know what I have. Most people don't know what it is. They know it's a bright yellow car. Right. That's very cool. They said they got 85 more horse out of the 6.1 over the 5.7. And you're still pulling 20 miles a gallon with That's not bad at all, now, though. Now, that's highway miles. Right. In town, you won't get 16, 17. Well, of course, it depends on how you drive it, too. Yeah. If you're always if you running. Your foot in it, yeah. You're not going to get 20 miles to a gallon. No, no. Wow. Well, well, Vicky, that is a very cool car. I really, really appreciate you letting me come out and shoot a video of it. You are quite welcome. Thank you so much. Folks, there you go. 2007 Super B to uh, match her husband's 16. Actually, a 69 Super B to match the 2007 Super B. But like I said, these are one of a thousand, and I've been looking for one to shoot. I just hadn't found one nice enough to really bring to you. And when I saw this car, it took a little bit of driving to get here, but I knew I wanted to uh, make a video of it. So, anyways, hope you all have enjoyed it. Have a good day. See ya.